the fog and blood settled. And there was a clear victor left standing. Hello, 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 hello. After a long, long time, we're back here in the world of Zingo. And um, I had to watch the last episode to kind of refresh, refresh my memory. And uh, okay. Wow, it's going to take me a minute to get refreshed here again. It feels like I have to do this every time we play this. Um, but the Zimtorians, wait, did their color change? They were blue. They turned to pink because they have a queen now, I think. Huh. Or no, King is Hosa. Or I don't know. Um. Oh yeah, that is awesome. So actually, we're gonna go to what they were, but if Zimmer wants to change, because this is his kingdom, if he wants to change it, he is more willing, or you know, I'm more willing to do that for you. We're just gonna go with this for now, I think. We can change the banner emblem and design. We'll keep all that the same for now. This isn't the exact same blue, but it's close enough. So I forgot we do have the Zaborg orcs who I do remember, man. They were almost like it was almost over for them. But put this big wall up for them to keep them alive from the the dead deadly rhinos. And they're kind of trying to expand their more rebuild. They're definitely behind, but it's basically the Potanians who have taken over, and they eliminate Sakab, the Sakab people who. This is still an orc race, and I like that, that it doesn't... It's gonna let you know, like, okay, this is a human race that w waged war. Looks like they're actually still fighting, possibly? Let's let time play. At the same, are they still fighting? Or no? Have they enslaved the orcs? It looks like they're... You know, just gonna keep let them stay orcs. They're not gonna wipe the orcs out. That's cool. Um, the Batanians though seem to be taking over. King Hosea is dead of the Zentorians' kingdom. The 70-year-old um passed away. That's a big thing now. Yeah, the Zentorians have ships. So do the Batanians though. The Batanians look very strong. The Sakab people are. Basically, done. New village created by the, Zo the Zaborg Orcs. They're trying to slowly rebuild. Um, I don't know. But there is a ship here that looks... <laughs> oh my goodness. The Centaurians, one of them just drove the ship right onto land and now it's beached. It's time to have a little bit of fun in this game, though. I feel like we haven't had any fun in the game yet. So what we're going to do, I think, is, um, yeah, there's not really much difference as far as that go. Map names? Oh, okay, you can turn that off. Important events. Shows all major events. It doesn't keep anything other than what you've been playing still, so. Anyways, this is what the world's looking like. Um, the Patanians looking like they're going to. We're gonna keep it like this. Oh yeah, the Batanians are looking very, very good. Lemon seed creates a lemon biome. It's a pretty acceptable biome. You know what that's from, right? Make some chaos happen and see who can survive. We're gonna put a tornado down right smack dab in the middle of the map. How do I delete the tornado? I don't know. Imagine it uh, in the in middle of the ocean right now. It could hit wherever it could hit. Who knows? It looks like it's gonna go up north and hit the Batanians though. Um, I guess I should probably figure out how to take it away after after a while. Um, we're gonna do one down the middle. Oh, it's stretched and an earthquake it hits Botania, the Great Botania, the original Botania, not by a lot. But a big, nice earthquake down the middle right here. And it actually is going to cause 
a longer route for this t this side of the map to get across because look at that it's now covered in sand those ships can they're gonna have to go around nobody yet here but Patanians are slowly rebuilding they actually just founded a city what did they name it I wonder let's see the name is Inama Inama <laughs> okay oh whoa 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 this is okay this is let's pause it for a second because this is actually a surprise move Zimtorians decided to go left I don't think they know what's waiting for them here well there's your first answer a hundred and three year old flat horn dape he's wise he's fat and he's strong and he's healthy too but I don't think I think they don't realize what they are getting themselves into unless they're looking to try and start war with the orcs which they may be better off doing these rhinos are something else, and uh, this could really hurt the Zimtorians, man, their growth. I was expecting them to try and go up here, man, and or at least try and go over here. I know that's a, definitely a way farther way. I just think if you try to take over the orcs, man, or even try to grow back here, it's going to weaken you, and it's only going to help the Patanians take over the map. Yeah, okay, here he is, the new king. He's 67. He's never killed anybody. He's got three children. Meat is his favorite food. He's got a gold tooth. He's wise, blessed, and he's attractive. Or she, well, it's a he, so it's king. But anyways, um, view village. So this village isn't popping up yet. Um... Which is weird, right? Oh no, here it goes. Okay, it popped up. So, we're going to name this Danzer. And Zimmer is definitely, obviously, more than willing to change it. But it's the Desert Danzer Daniel Zimmer. You know, okay, you know, it is what it is. Bro. And that, that tornado is just staying there. It doesn't really seem to do much. So, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to cause an earthquake in every um, kingdom. Kind of see... Who gets the worst? So we're going to hit these guys right in the middle, man. Continuation. Ooh. And they get hit pretty hard. I mean, pretty dang hard, actually. So hard. I think it did it just demolish the, the city name. Like, the city's just gone. That's a pretty big one. For the Zimtorians, man, I'm going to hit their holy... Island, which I I think this is gonna sting really bad. I, this almost hurts to do this, but it's happened. Oh, and it went the long way across. Oh, and it caused a mountain. Guys, if you don't know, that's why they're getting hurt right now. Oh my goodness. It's completely oh this is the worst. It's completely oh trapped this whole Zentorian army. There's nowhere they can go. The Zimtorians probably don't know how to swim. Well, I guess they can try and climb over. No, I don't think they can. Wait, can they get out of this? Okay, they're, okay, they're free. Just barely, though. The whole island is now split in half to where they had to literally make a, a new little city that's, I mean, not going to do too well. No, it caused the... So there's different things that can happen from an earthquake. This caused a whole long mountain. It has sp split the holy island of the Zimtorians in half. And now it's time for the orcs to get hit. They're going to get hit in the middle as well. And oh, uh, I think they got the least of it. I think they're going to be okay. And it actually just made landfall technically for the first time. And then came back out to shore. So we'll have to keep an eye on that interesting um it's kind of making its way down south from maybe all the hurricane or earthquakes happening it started here in the middle of the island ah dude that really that just kind of stings to see let's um let's take all that off right now 
Yeah, look at that, man. A, a freaking mountain right down the middle. Tanians overall are just still kind of dominating as now they're at the highest point on the map, the most northern point on the map where there's a lot of polar bears, but they seem to be doing just fine. Already 54 population. Or maybe they were there already. Oh my goodness. They, I just noticed what they did. They eradicated the orcs. I'm pretty sure that's what they just did. Yes, they. that's exactly what they did. Holy crap. Look, this whole continent is abandoned and dead. This is where all the orcs were at. They took it over Sakab and then just left it to rot. Wow. How crazy is that? I mean, am I the only one that thinks that's crazy? Also, why can't I see, um, the, like, okay, here we go. This is what I want to see. Yeah, it's gone. It's completely gone. It's just nothing but, um, humans now. They basically made the orcs go extinct. They took them over and then left them there. Wow. The Batanians continue to dominate. Um, okay. Oh, wow. The... The orcs, somehow, they, they, they've got around. Where are all the rhinos at? They, they're, they're actually doing it. They're surviving with the rhinos, beating out the rhinos somehow. I'll be honest, I think the other factions here, these other kingdoms, need a little bit of luck. They need a little bit of nature to come in and help them, but I don't know. If we take a look at... Oh, there, there you go. There's the, uh, let's take a look at the total population. I mean, double what Zimtorians have. The Borgors at 200. Uh, I guess it's their strength in a way. Way better than, yeah. The Patanians. Oh, well, I feel like they know what's going to happen as they dominate. But we're going to end it here. It does look like that hurricane is really starting to threat those Zimtorians. Um, let me know what you guys think, man, and uh, I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.